this video. We can teach you how to connect Sony A7 III to PC slash computer. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. Connecting the Sony A7 III to a PC is extremely simple. Regardless if you are using a PC, a laptop, a MacBook, you will be able to get it to work and you can use it as a webcam, you can do remote shootings and whatever you wish to manage within the Sony camera. The only thing that you need to download to set this up is the Imaging Edge desktop app. So to make sure that this connection works and the camera gets detected as a valid device, download the Imaging Edge Desktop app. You can find it on the official Sony website or just look for Imaging Edge Desktop on Google. Now click on download and you will be redirected into this page where you can download for Windows or Mac. So choose the appropriate OS that you are using and once you have it downloaded, you will be able to finish establishing this connection. The Sony A7 III has one of the easiest connection methods possible. So first, before proceeding, go over to the setup icon on the camera settings, go to the fourth page and you will find USB connection. What you have to do is make sure that this is set to PC remote. So if it is set to auto, change it to PC remote. This is very important, otherwise you might encounter issues while establishing the connection. And with this done, you can now use a quality USB cable to establish the connection. You plug one end into the camera, so the Sony a7 III, and the other end goes into your PC, laptop, or whatever device you are using. It doesn't matter which cable you use, but I would highly recommend choosing a high quality cable just to be sure. And with this done, the Sony camera will be detected when you open any device or any application such as OBS, Google Meet, Zoom, and so on, it is going to appear under the list of available devices, and you can choose to use your Sony a7 III. I hope I was able to help you on how to connect Sony a7 III to PC slash computer. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.